Hi, my name's Arian. I'm from Colton here, Hyde Park, and I'll be styling Samantha's hair today. Um, so Stormy, what I want you to use on this hair, I want you to use the red shampoo and condition on this hair. Okay, cool. Always make sure that you're using moisture-rich shampoos, conditioners, and mm -hmm. treatments at home. Okay. 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 Um, obviously, um, um, with your kind of hair, is that it takes a lot of styling mm -hmm. um, to get it to do something. Mm -hmm. All right. It does. So mm -hmm. it's going to be um, bombarded with heat. It's going to be bonded with chemicals in the water when you mm -hmm. shampoo. So to always find things that are super loaded with moisture okay. to help to create softness, um, softness. Um, and then to try and do moisture treatments every seventh shampoo, yeah, to, okay. yeah, instead of a conditioner, to help to keep this hair um, easy, and easily manageable, and soft and supple. Okay. Yeah. Feels good. <laughs> I think what is going to be um, a good option for you is to try and find a way where you can go and rather have your hair relax professionally okay. for two reasons mm -hmm. often the products that you find on the shelf at home mm -hmm. don't have enough conditioning agents in to protect your hair All right. okay mm -hmm. and then also obviously technically um, people don't always follow the rules exactly mm -hmm. so they tend to overlap mm -hmm. and the hair just gets weak and keeps breaking okay. and that could be why your hair just isn't growing like you're saying mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. like you were saying you're using dark and lovely and I was explaining to you earlier about how Sometimes the oil is not refined enough, and I'm sure you've noticed it, that the hair still has that greasy feel. Mm -hmm. Now this product is going to give you the softness and the protection that you need, um, and the strength without that oily feel. Okay. So, if we look at your facial shape, mm -hmm. okay. Um, you have what we call a heart shape that's kind of narrow in the chin over here and then rounds out through the top over here. Okay. So on your facial shape, you always, always want to kind of keep it skinny like you're doing now okay. through this area, mm -hmm. but creating volume in, at the bottom over here okay. or through the sides to okay. soften out and create balance in that area over mm -hmm. there. Okay. So today, when we style your hair, I'm going to be showing you how to, to curl your hair particularly using diagonal sections when you're using your curling tongue mm -hmm. to create that kind of flicked away um, but curly area in this area over here okay. of your chin, mm -hmm. okay? And voila! Yeah, that looks beautiful, huh? It does, thank yeah. you! Uchikeleza izinda ngalali, asishi. Oh, kunzima sinamali. Umama watu tata uya dalanjalo. Uchikeleza izinda ngalali, asishi.